You've been in here for the last hour breaking boxes down. Why are you doing this? You would not believe. Come here. How much I've got? I don't even know this car could fit this much. <laughs> oh my god. It is stacked to the brim. With from all our furniture. You know why. Why are you Do doing this? Do you guys this? know why? Today we are picking up our brand new car. This is where it's gonna be. I don't want any mess in here. I want no boxes, no rubbish. I want it to be driving in our new car and it's gonna look beautiful. I actually can't believe you managed to fit all of this in here. That's packaging from a sofa, a dining room table, outdoor furniture. A washing machine, TV, a TV cabinet, a bed. That is only 20% of our house complete right now. That's crazy. So we're, gonna, we're gonna be doing this with all these boxes for probably non-stop for the next six months. Six months straight. But I hope you guys are having a beautiful day wherever you are in the world. Today is a very special and exciting day like Harry said because today is the day that we're gonna be picking up our dream, dream car. When I say dream car, this has been on our vision boards and our Pinterest for the last five years or more. When I was younger, I said I either want this car or a Lamborghini, and if I get either one, I'm happy. And today, we're picking it up. Like, I can't, I can't believe it. It's so weird. I feel like when you actually dream of something for so, so long, and then the day finally comes where it's actually happening, it's at such a surreal moment. And it, I feel like this whole entire move to Australia has been a version of that. Like, every day I wake up, and I feel like I've just dreamt about everything that's happened, and I'm about to wake up from it. It just doesn't seem real. This yeah. is it, folks. We're here. This is what we dreamed of five years ago. We said we want to move to Australia. We want to get our dream car. It's all coming true And this just proves to you guys that genuinely anything you can put your head to comes true Probably you've been sat here for the past three hours. I don't know what to do with myself <laughs> You I'm, look sad. I'm excited. I just want to get it. Is it time to go? Yes. Oh, it is? It is time to go. Oh, well then, let's Come go. Then. Are you ready? Nervous. I don't know why I'm nervous. I'm nervous too. Why? I don't know because it's a new car. <gasps> I'm gonna be scared to drive this car. I you already think? know I'm nervous for that. Don't be silly. You're a good, you're a good driver. You're better than me sometimes. Yeah, but I'm just worried. It's because you don't want to crash it. Yeah, exactly. Because it's such a nice car. Okay, guys. So the car is right behind us, and we're choosing not to look at it because I want to like have a big surprise. Yeah, I want to get. But I can it. see there's a big bow on it. Did yeah, you see the bow? I can. Oh my god. Oh, I want to look so bad. I think there's balloons as well. I'm so excited. I'm gonna look. I looked. <laughs> there's two pink balloons. Oh my god. Okay, I'm not looking because I want to surprise myself. You've looked already. Yeah. Okay. Three, two, one. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, what the hell? Car. That's crazy. How is that our car? I'm actually know. shaking. Yeah. What the hell? I I don't have any words. <laughs> Genuinely, <laughs> I have no words. Like, I can't believe this is our car. Like We just had to take a minute to really like take this in. But now we're going to show you guys. So I hope you're ready. We're going to give a countdown. Ready? Three, two, one. Let's show you the car. How are you feeling? <laughs> I feel like I'm dreaming. I don't feel like this is real right now. It doesn't, does it? I can't no. take it in. I can't process anything. I just can't believe. I was just saying this on TikTok. Mm. I can't believe it five years ago, like my, I had a car that had a broken window. I couldn't even afford 20 pound petrol. And now we've just brought our brand new Jeep. Crazy. Anything's possible, guys. Anything I swear, is. like you just put your mind to it. And I think I'm more happy with the fact that like we've achieved this more than like we've got it. Yeah. But that's the thing to bear in mind, guys. Like when you get stuff like this, you can't get caught up and be like, you know, cause this doesn't really mean anything. It's no. just a materialistic object. But it's the fact that we've got it and achieved it. It's that's the process the of process. achieving it. Yeah. The process. <laughs> <laughs> well, are you driving it out? Do you want me to drive it out? Yeah, I'm too nervous. Yeah? Oh, I'll, I'll happily drive it out. <laughs> okay, guys, so we're out of the showroom right now. We've got the car. It's officially ours. I still don't understand how this is our car. Neither I do I. It. I have no words in my body <laughs> to explain it. But we're going to give you guys a full car tour because I know you want to see it. We're going to run around the car, show you everything this car has. This is the outside. We went for the white. We were debating to go for black, weren't we? But we I feel were. like every, and everybody says... if you says, guys saw our TikTok, you were saying that you wanted black. I did. And this car was the exact one we were sat in when I said <laughs> I wanted this car. I knew and you were going to say that. Who won the argument? It took some convincing because Rosie originally said said she liked this one. And then I was like, I like this one. Then we switched. So we ended up going with the white. I feel like this looks so much nicer because it really highlights all these black features on it here. It does. And if you have a black car, you don't notice the little like extra bits because yeah. it just all looks black. Yeah. I feel like a lot of people as well said that black cars get so hot in this country. And also we would have had to wait six months to get a black car. So yeah. I feel like this was all just meant to be. It was meant to be. It was. For like the past five years, you've had on your vision board this a white exact Jeep. One. This exact So it was meant to be. The extra bits we got added, we got tint on the whole way through, which is actually UV tint as well. So like I won't get sunburned. So yeah, that was an extra thing we added because I was like, if we're gonna be in this car and I don't wear sun cream one day, I don't want to have burnt skin. So protection. yeah, we got 
I don't know what size wheels these are. I'm pretty sure they're like 35 inches. Like in comparison to me, when I bend down, they're pretty much the same size. They are. And but one thing we're going to be doing to this car to actually change it is to do with the wheels, isn't we're it? We're going to get bigger wheels, like the Rubicon, but maybe a little bit less. And we're going to get black rims. And I would say genuinely, that is the only thing we're going to change about this yeah. car. I'd like to have some little things popping up here. Oh, there. what the little hook thing? I think it's, yeah, I don't know what it is. It just looks cool. <laughs> I am obsessed with this car. Like we actually have a picture. Me and Rosie drove this car for the first time. I think it was like three years ago. Yeah. And you guys will see later. Our best friend Cal is also obsessed with this car. He, yeah. You guys know Cal. He's been in so many of our videos. He is obsessed with this car as well. And this is his dream car. And we're going to call him later and get his reaction because he has no idea we got it. He and doesn't. He's, he's not going to believe us. We keep saying to him, we got a Jeep. He's like, no, you haven't. He, he doesn't said, believe us. He said he'll only believe us when it's actually in our garage. So yeah. we're going to FaceTime him and screen record that and show you guys because that's going to be a really good reaction. The inside of the Jeep is probably the best bit because if you guys know, Rubicons come with like a red thing here, which yeah. is the whole thing's red. We didn't like that. We wanted it to be black. We finally found one that was black. I didn't even know this was a car. No. I thought it was just Rubicons and like the night thingies. Night Eagle. This is the Jeep Overland. Yeah, everything comes with like a white stitching. So all on here is all white stitching. Leather seats with the Overland here in white as well. I just think it looks way more aesthetic. Yeah, it does. It's just more clean. It looks way more clean, yeah. The best thing about this car, you guys might know this if you're a big fan of Jeep, you can literally pop these off, take the roof off, and you can literally push this forward, the, the whole windscreen. We only just found this out. Yeah. You can push the whole windscreen forward and it locks on to the front of the car. And it's just like you're in a massive open. Convertible? Yeah. I don't think we'll ever put the windscreen down, but we'll definitely be taking these top bits off. Imagine when we're driving on the beach and we've taken the roof off and the dogs are in the back. Oh my God. They're going to love it. I still can't believe we're even here in the first. Like, how is this real life? I don't know. It comes with a heated steering wheel. Yeah, I don't think you'll ever be using I that. I don't think we'll ever use, considering no. I'm sweating right now. I think I need like an aircon steering wheel. <laughs> yeah. I love these bits because you can like get out and like this little handle. So if I'm going really fast, which I probably will, you can be like, <laughs> like, like on the a road roller coaster. Yeah. Okay, and this is Rosie's favorite bit. This is my favorite bit. I love there's this like white hard casing on the tire because a lot of Jeeps typically just have the tire on the back. I love how it's just white and it matches everything. The main reason why we wanted to get this Jeep rather than any other Jeep was because every other Jeep that we've seen has this back bit as black plastic and these bits here. Yeah, it's like almost like this the whole way around on yeah. these bits and this bit and even the roof, but on this car, the whole thing is just like metal. a metal. It gives me like G-Wagon vibes. It does from the G-Wagon vibes. This bit here, yeah. because it's so square. This boot's so cool as well, how you can just open it in two sections like that. And then you can do this bit. I haven't, haven't actually You just pop up, yeah. You do that. <laughs> so easy, what the hell? Our dogs are going to love that because Daisy's scared of boots. The only she? thing is, this comes with a huge subwoofer. So we're going to have to find a way to turn that off when the dogs are in the back. We are, because they'll get dogs... scared. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry, this. Massive slide. Oh, I that's gonna that's a It's gonna bite you. Ugh. Ah, it's biting me. What the hell? <laughs> that's gonna be a huge bite. Talking of bites, let me show you Harry's mosquito oh, bite. I keep zooming in. <laughs> oh look, it's actually got blood. There's a little blood spot. Oh my god. What the hell? That's, that's gonna, gonna go be like a massive bite. This is how I go, by the way, when I get a bite. That is how my skin goes when I get a bite. I'm just gonna get covered in bites. It's not good. <laughs> I'm just gonna shut these doors because this is like maybe a place that spiders could come in our oh, car. Good point. I don't say that. <laughs> so this you can pull up and you can actually put like loads of ice packs in here. Put drinks in there food and then you can actually open this up and that works like a drain oh, it drains any so water it drains it that's so cool so we can just put all our drinks in there jam when we got this car this the guy gave us some jams that's very cute it's i don't know complimentary gift i don't know why he gave us some jams it's got yeah so whoever is harvest kitchen shout out to you <laughs> for the jams guys i do want to say again i know i said it when we first moved into our house but i appreciate you guys so much like this kind of stuff took us years to get and it's all thanks to you guys watching our videos and we're building this fan base and support base you guys that watch us and enjoy our content i will never be able to thank you enough it's everything that we it's ever everything, dreamed of yeah everything we ever dreamed of and guys like i tried doing youtube for 10 years and i met rosie and now we've achieved it and it's just like these kind of moments where you think wow how life we done does this? really give you what you want when you try i know it all paid off it us. all paid off whereabouts <laughs>